cute. It's the right way up. Um, I came to a conclusion today. I've been playing a lot of horse in the last few days. But I came to a conclusion today that the way I organise my art is actually kind of annoying. Um, horsey, horsey. Yay! We got first in a competition. Oh god, looking at my phone screen to see what's on my laptop screen hurts my eyes. I should just look at the screen and behind instead of, you know, trying to look at the phone screen. Eh, no. Um, but I came to the conclusion... Oh, ow. Switch to the screen. Thank you. I came to the... Oh god, I'm going to take my glasses off too. I came to the conclusion that the way I... Oh, no, there's too much drush still. Is this better? Kinda. No, I need my glasses on again. Ugh. I came to the conclusion the way I organise art is kind of annoying. Because you'll see that I... This is my general pictures folder. So I've got this art meme, I've got this art meme, I have other crap. I used to make monthly playlists for Spotify, don't do that now. Um, I've got video projects, uh, that's where the video stuff is. I could probably delete all the crap in here, honestly. Yeah, I could delete all this. Uh, it's annoying. I'll delete that later, if I remember. Species, I, I decided to make a species, I haven't got far into it. Tender is all of these. I think this is the smaller versions of them, I don't know. Mm. Eventually I will make another. I've, I mean, I, I need to. I've got writings in here, kind of weirdly organised. Tender, that's what goes. I have to divide each thing into three, three, each page into three parts so it will upload in decent quality. Comic set up, so we've got file sizes. Um, skins, Minecraft skins. I've only got my Minecraft skin in there. Grief. Eventually I'm going to redraw these pages. And, oh, I've already redrawed them once before apparently. I'm going to redraw them again. <laughs> and then do more pages. It's supposed to just be around Cario and her mother's funeral. This is Fantasy Elements. I didn't really do a whole lot with that. Maybe one day I'll do more with that. It was just supposed to be a series of vendor art. But it's, yeah. Inner here is my Stardew Valley fan comic. Here's the pages. I was redrawing them. One day I'll redraw another. This is the work in process, progress pages. I need to finish page four. Um, this is the thumbs for each page. Um, resources. Just random crap I have saved. And also, and this one is art people did for me. Yeah. So this is all from Art Fight. Some of the, there's a couple in here that are from last year that aren't actually organised very well. Like this is just called Main Care. I think that might be the username, I don't know. Uh, and this is one that Gavin, I mean Lucy drew Gavin for me once. So that wasn't part of Art Fight. This, I don't think it was part of Art Fight. I don't know. Uh, yeah, I need to reorganise so the things that aren't from this year's Art Fight also have who they'll buy on them. Um, progress, so mean stuff. These are all the empty ones because I like having the empty templates. These are then versus now stuff. Yep. And then we've got 2021, so that's this year's art. We've got personal art, I will not show you in there. Some of that I have posted, but for the most part, it's, you know, it's personal art. Um, color challenge, I haven't done this month yet. Um, Art summary of 2021. Art summary of 2021 there. You're not even looking. Ugh, my leg is uncomfortable. Um, this one here, I only put scenery pieces in it, so I need to do actually any art of scenery to be able to put something in there. Actually, I have done art of scenery. No, um, I need to do another for that tender series. These are my watermarks that I used this year. So we've got our I didn't actually delete that one. No, um, yeah, I will delete it. Um, so we've got this one. I put on my stuff that I do for Art Fight. This one is my everything. I use it for everything. That's not one of these other two things. And this is what I used for my Pride Art during Pride Month. 
um, yeah. So then if you go into a folder, this is January, there would be zero, this first one, recordings, time lapses, and then studies, and then sketches, emotes, transparent, so just the character with no background. I don't actually do save a transparent version that often. And then we've got the works and progresses. Um, I often just draw over one file for ages, so honestly there's it's it's never actually a current work in progress <laughs> well it's seldom ever a current and then layers i don't know why i have that i don't know what that means small smaller versions of the big art because my canvas tends to be big um february you'll see it's the same thing repeated except without a layers and then march same thing repeated um why do i have two of whips and then April, same thing repeated, except I did some things for Discord, so I have a file for that. And then May, same thing repeated. And then June, same thing repeated. And then, and then in July, I got annoyed because there was so much art. <laughs> well, I've also got thumbs because thumbs for my art fighter text. Um, and then supplies, so, you know, art fight frame for my thumbs, two banners I made to use on Discord, this, I wanted to do more art inspired by these colours, and then I also have, um, so first batch, all the art I did in the first half of the month, uh, and then second batch, all the art I did in the second half of the month, but, um, I've come to the conclusion the way I organise art is kind of annoying, like, I like that it's organized by time frame but it doesn't make it easy to find characters like if I want to sp like I know I can look on on Toy House because a lot of my characters are on there but not all of them are and you know I don't I don't put my big big files on Toy House like um so this is my page for my troll sona my and this is the most recent art I did that I've got here and the file size is probably, I don't know, small, because um, manage images, upload image. The largest image you can put on to here is up to four megabytes in size. But if we go over and we look at um, the speech art, you'll see it's 10 megabytes, so I can't put the giant files on Toy House, which is vaguely annoying. Yeah, uh, so I was thinking next month, January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, August is next month, oh crap, so next month, 008, yeah, August, So in this one we have 001 whips, 001 whips, using one hand is vaguely annoying, um, I know it's not August yet but August is soon, 002 transparent, 002 Transparent. I don't really save the transparent version all that often. Um, three sketch. Um, zero zero three sketches. Yeah. Um, what's? You'd think I'd have them memorized. Small. Uh, I wish there was a quicker way I could do this. I don't know a quicker way I can do this. <laughs> um, did I do the small? No. Zero zero four. I'm gonna smell sp spell small properly this time. Small. Um, studies. studies and then recordings. I don't really do studies enough honestly. 
studies. I'm gonna just type it root for short. Why not? I can do that. Emotes, supplies. Emotes and then supplies. Emotes and then supplies. Emotes. So then I thought instead of having it referred to in batches, what if I have it so we have 009 finished art and then within that art file folder so we we click on it and then within that art folder we have folders that divide into char char characters so say I draw Cario I make her a folder and then all the art I do of Cario throughout this month goes there yeah I feel like it makes sense I mean, when you when you save an art piece to your computer, it's um, you'll you get a date on it anyway. So I can I can look at this fault this piece of art properties, and it will say um, created then, and it will also say when it was modified and when it was accessed. So really all the file, all the information is there, so I don't really need to have it in order within the file of when it was created. Um, I've also already got, uh, you'll see in here, July Summary Part 1, so that's just got all the, uh, all the art from the first batch. And when I want to complete the video, I'll put all this into a second half video and then I'll shove them together and then I'll do the voiceover and it'll be easy. I still have a video I need... Why do I have toilet paper there? I still have a video that I need to post to upload, but it's it's on that laptop. And this laptop isn't logged into my YouTube account. Yeah. Go over there. This laptop isn't logged into my YouTube account um, videos, and so I can't upload it from this one but I've got the episode right here ready to be uploaded so I just need to move it over to onto the laptop that I can upload from or even onto my phone I guess because I can upload from my phone I think and then I but I, I usually use it move it over using USBs but I don't know where all my USBs are they kind of vanished during the move um, I didn't say it at any point but it is currently the 29th of July so Art Fight is nearly over Wow. And yeah. Speed Art and Chat was the one that recorded today. It's called Excuse Me While I Die because I coughed a lot during it and that wasn't great. Um yeah. Art Fight. And then this is my channel content. That's the video that's posting tomorrow. And then I really need the video off that laptop over there to post here. Um why do I have ten uh, more recommendations turn off all from that turn off all from penguins I don't really need these <sighs> why does it turn off all recommendation thanks oh I didn't know I could do that and immediately have a clean in notifications because I'm always uh, I don't want that notifications um, notify me. Mm, I don't really need to know that. Yeah. Yeah, those are fine. Cool. But, um, art fight is still going. We're nearly at the end. I don't know what I've done since the last one you saw. Um, I think I probably showed you these. I probably showed you the Vampir Flugel one. Um, so, Agatha got an attack. I'm so happy. Agatha's first attack by Vampir Flugel. Look at them! I like how they did the scar and I like the kind of plush look to their hair. Um, so, that's by Vampir Flugel. 
and they did their hair colour just fine. Um, it's difficult to get Nicus's hair because it is an awkward shade of purple, if I'm completely honest. I don't know why I did it that awkward shade of purple. And then I revenged by drawing their character Lance. And this tab is Corio. Look at her! Isn't she cute? So this was a revenge because I drew something for them. This is drawn by Cosmic Zaz. Look at it. Look at her. She's so cute. I love how they drew her hair. It's not it's not exactly how Cario's hair is, but I think it's close enough that most people who don't know Cario as a character wouldn't really think twice. But, and I really do love how they drew her hair. Um, so they were doing a revenge because I drew a Tori, and this is the art I did of a Tori. That rose was like low-key really difficult to do. Um, and this is, look, Shishi. Shishi? Shishi? Is that how it's, I don't know how it's pronounced. Drew Gavin. Look at her. I really like that she did this little hand pointy fella with these little fellas. It looks like she uses the crayon brush. Oh, are you a she? Uh, what are your pronouns, my buddy? Eh, you are a she. And are they then? Oh, I love that for you. Um, but yes, um, they drew um, Gavin. Oh, I didn't notice the little heart in the eye. That's so cute. Oh, and the little crown and the little lines with the dots. This is why you go back and look at art people did. Oh, I particularly like the shading in this section of here. Look at that. Um, so they drew, they, they drew Gavin and she did a really good job of that. And that was a revenge because I drew Gwendolyn for her. Um, Gwendolyn. Because they had remarked that their characters that had mobility aids weren't really getting attacked. So I wanted to draw, draw Gwendolyn and I wanted to make sure the cane was included. I probably mentioned this in another video. Open for friendly fire, mostly fighting. I love how they do this um, steampunk themed thing on all these thumbs. So cute. And I'm glad they're getting a good amount of attacks. Yay. Um, in the starlight. Look. Agatha. Isn't this so pretty? Look at how they shaded the, the hair. What are your pronouns, my good bud? Just, ugh, I don't want a new window. So, Nerdaddy. Um, she, her. Oh, you have a pretty profile. Um, so, she drew Agatha. Look, I love, look at her. I mean, look at them. I do like it. Thank you, Nerdati. So this was revenge because I drew the character Althea. I drew Althea. So yay. So I had a few exciting days because people were revenging. It's fun. Um, I have it on my profile that um, will sell soul to yell to attack Agatha because that was the character I most wanted drawn. I've got it. I've got my characters displayed, so it's characters I want most drawn, starting here um, to least drawn. But I would love for all of them to eventually be drawn because, like, I love all my characters. Poppy has not been drawn yet. Um, Cassie has not been drawn yet. Uh, Gavin, was that your first attack? Or had you been attacked before? I love Gavin. I've had her for a while. Oh yeah, what was your first attack? Because that's art I did. And um, I, I, I'm really proud of this. Like, I like the colours. I feel like I just, I like the colours. I did Gavin in this blue shirt to kind of match the, their character, Molten. Molten belongs to um, Cactus Butto. And Cactus Butto was very delightful. Um, and then Yuna hasn't been attacked yet. And neither has Miles or Adonis. Which is fine. Um, eventually I'm going to draw more of Adonis myself and I, I'm planning on doing a comic based around Agatha and Miles I have kind of started it but it's it's slow going I'm not really practiced in making comics um, so yeah I think you've seen most of these attacks um, Beach Day is the one I was talking about before so this has my Trollsona here this is Cosmos, this is Ruzio so Cosmos and Ruzio belong to Scribe Tarts um, they had it in their thing that they wanted pictures of um, of of their two characters, and they liked the idea of a beach day as a prompt. So I um, beach day, and I had my troll sona hanging out with them because I thought it was cute because both my troll sona and Cosmos have teal blood, 
I feel like they're kind of opposites of each other because I tend to draw my character, my troll sona is kind of lean and um, the hair is very, you know, it's in a braid, it's well kept, it's sleek and um, and then there's this this crop top over top of this belt and um, so it's kind of all very inward facing including this little icon on the thing and the horns, you know, they point outwards and then they go inwards and then um, scribed characters um, Cosmo it feels the very opposite because they've got kind of a more hourglass I mean they're supposed to be more pear shaped I should have made the shoulders more in maybe they're supposed to be more pear shaped and their horns kind of point outwards and the hair is more big and, and, and more plump and I feel like they're just opposites in every way um, which I think is very fun um, Cosmos. So this is Scribe Hearts character, Scribe Hearts. So this is uh, done by Scribe. What are your pronouns? <laughs> Sorry, I I I I accidentally used the wrong pronouns on someone once, and now I'm just like, you know what? Let me check. Um, so she they, another she they. Love my she they's. Um, um, so this is Cosmos, um, made of blood. Um, so they've got kind of the top, I, I based the outfit I drew in that beach scene on this, but with slight differences. So they've got it kind of pulled in here. I kept this corset looking thing because I thought it was cool. Um, but yeah, maybe one day I'll draw Cosmos again because I like Cosmos. And um, Scribe Tart actually has other um, Homestuck characters. Oh, Vasir. Ah, oh, Vasir. This is the Toy House profile. Okay, I have read and understand the above ones. Um, I would consider drawing this here, but they've only got this one image. They've got, oh, they used the doll maker, but they've... Uh, what? You, the doll makers are a thing? They've only got this one picture of this here, of the, this... Uh, oh! I didn't know that was a thing. Um, oh, um, one, two, uh, is there a better way of going through this? View all parts for troll. Um, Crikey. Can you show me your... Can you sh... Uh, look. Oh. I can... I can see... See that... I wanted to see all the horns, please. Um... Wow. Never seen this sight before. Left horn. Oh. I don't know what I'm looking at. This doesn't make any sense. Uh, confusing. Oh, the horns are loading in now. Okay. Oh, 14 would be kind of giant. 14, maybe. Like, that's the opposite of what mine has. Uh... I'm kind of inclined towards 14 so far, even if they're... Ooh, 19 is alright too. 14. Um, nothing is unique. There has to be someone who's done something the same. Apparently not. Well, I mean, there's still so many more to go, but 14 so far is our best bet. Oh, they look like antlers. I love that. I should use this whenever I make another. Oh, that one's cool, but um, I don't need the jewelry little bits. 14. <gasps> 92. 92. 
Okay, 92. Let's just see if there's any of that work better though. Mm, 92 or that one? Uh, I think I'll go with 92. Yeah, we'll go with 92. Um, these are so cool though. I always, I've been meaning for a while to make more um, Homestuck characters, aside from my Trollsona. Uh, 92, 92, 92, 92, I'm sorry I'm just repeating it so I remember it, 92, jeez there's so many of these. Um, can I just set you to 92 for the moment? Uh, oh, you can... Um, uh, my character doesn't have, um, I need teal blood, I need teal blood, teal blood my dude, teal blood, teal blood, randomized just colors, okay, lime, I need teal. Good way to make a character though. Teal. There we go. Teal. Ah, 92. Uh, not really sure what's going on with that pose, but you know what? That's fine. Um. Wow, there's so many. I was asleep not long ago. How am I falling asleep? Uh, oops, sorry. How how is my hand in front of the camera? There we go. Um, pretty much just put my hand exactly where I was again. This is so cool. Like you'd use this as a little base and then draw a more complex version of it. Uh, so many. Um, my character doesn't wear glasses. You'd think they would. Zero? No fin, thank you. Where's the other fin? Ah, oh, here front. Ooh. Um, what is this? That's arms? Nope, that's glasses. Why did it show arms before? <laughs> Dirt glasses. That's fun. But um, no glasses, thank you. Oh, eyes. Oh. I think mine's got very typical eyes, if I'm completely honest. Uh, let me see the hair fronts. Sorry, this is probably really boring for y'all, you know. Um, <gasps> four! I like four. Four. Doesn't really show my character's braid that they have, but it's fine. Eyes now. Oh, I do like that one, number one. That's one we already looked at. You're waiting for the eyes to appear. Ah, uh, I don't think this will be several clips long. I think this will just be one video. <laughs> Sorry, you get to listen to me ramble and check out this doll maker, because I've never seen it before. Waiting for the eyes to load on these little fellas. Wah. Dang. Whoever made this is pretty awesome. Oh, oh, that one's got little little fellas. Um, it takes a while for the eyes to load in, doesn't it? Though, yeah. Do I just wanna? 
randomly click through eyes until we find one we like. Ooh, a little person disappeared. Come back. Come back. Mm hmm. Okay. Where did you go? My friend. There's nothing wrong with my internet. It's fine. It's fine. You can view more dolls. It's fun. Oh, it just opens up. It just... Yeah. Yeah. That's cased. Oh! There we go. I like seven. I like seven. I like seven, I think. No, nineteen. Nineteen. No, seven. I think I'll go with seven. Thirty. 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 Mouth. Show me all the canon symbols, actually. Um, you'll appear in your own time. Show me all the canon symbols. Mine is Liga. Liga. So what number is Liga? Ow. The way I'm sitting hurts. Do I have a cat under my foot? No. A cat under my foot. Oh, my legs are cold. I'm wrapped in a blanket. Not that y'all can see that, but I'm wrapped in a blanket. Oh, crap. TV, come back. I need a leg. Uh, crap, I'm looking at the... I need a leg. What number is my Liga friend? Oh, that one's cool. Uh, but I need Liga. Taking a while to get there. It's not like I'm even good at recognizing any other symbol either, so it's not like I know when I'm getting close. There it is, one five eight. One five eight. One five eight. There you go. What's this? Oh. Would it be 158? No? Yeah, whatever. We won't have that one. We don't need two symbols on the face paint. What's this? Oh, I don't think we need face paint. It's fun though. Oh, gross. I don't know what that is, what that is doing. Okay, body. Um. Oh. Oh. Show me all your bodies. Show me all your bodies. You know, I think this video is actually getting long enough. Y'all don't need to watch me do that whole thing. You can look at my troll signer's profile on Toy House if you're actually interested in how that resulted. But if, I think if I continue trying to talk to the camera while scrolling and looking around, I will fall asleep. <laughs> Which is boring, but sometimes it'd be like that. I will see you in the next video if you got through this whole thing. Thank you for watching. I should be showing you the art of the art of the art stuff at the end. Yeah. See ya.